Back with another update. I just got done cutting the grass. Um, so, um, a few things happened yesterday. First, I bought this for my iPad and phone. That's a little holder. Pull it down, whatever. So my mom had to go grab it yesterday. It broke off. You know, it's like 15, 20 bucks. I'm just gonna order a new one. Or I can just put some strong glue in there and just glue it back. But if I do that, I don't think it'll be able to twist. So. Let's order a new one. Um, secondly, so my subs I had in here, you know, one was puncher and the dust cap was punctured, so I was coming out to my car yesterday. I had my music playing, and bam, this happened. Uh, this ripped, and I think it was punctured right here. So then this one's still the same. So I got the ZVXs. So I'm about to take uh, everything out, even the carpet back there in the trunk and I got this trunk kit that I'm up down the mat so that's today's project so let my phone charge but I'll pop the trunk so you take all this shit out It don't rain. It looks like it's gonna rain. So I take all this out. It goes there. I may need you. Ooh, that's my damn toe. Take all my batteries out. I'm gonna switch that to that. No, no, I'm not. Actually, I should go buy another one. That way I can have my four channel because my fracty amp. It's back here. So yeah, I gotta take this stuff out. I gotta take this out. This back piece. So I can sun deaden the trunk. Yeah, I'm gonna sun deaden pieces right there. So I guess I get started. Um, I still do got my 12K. That would've been tragic. So you can see, got my 12K. Um, still got that 12 box. That was built for my DC level five. The ZVX came out of this. Um, if we, man, you get all of your nose, dude. It's a mess in here, boy. Get this garage together. So here's the ZVXs. VXF. Um, there's my platinum. What the hell is this? I don't know what that is. Well, this 
south part is bad. Let me check my other subs. I don't like that. Mm. Everything else is fine. I need to drop this off to Cody. That's fine. That's yeah, still fine. Alright. Everything else is just fine. Alright, so we good in here. Alright, I got my car in the garage. Got it out the heat. Trying to get some shade. Um, so now I'm about to start taking stuff out. Um, here's my four channel right here. Here's my Trent kit sound button. So let's start the process. I think my tools outside. I don't know if I can squeeze. That should be squeeze. No? What's that here? I need nothing really. My tools are right there. Sorry. My car still on? Keys are in. What the hell? There it goes. That's off. We need to get the amps off now. All right, let's get started. All right, I got the amp rack out. I got my amp out, which is right here. Here's the model. Here's the model. 3500. I got my LCTY Pro. That's the one I had in there before. Um, so next, let's get these batteries out. Um, I'm going to plug over here. Suit your core right there. Just throw these on the charger. Some of this stuff out of here. This is, this is all four gauge wire. Let's sit that in this box. I low key want to see if that'll fit in here. Um. Let me find a tape measure real quick. So this is 40 and a half. Now if I measure this box. That is 43. I'm wondering. What's this from this? Now this box is 43 inches. From here to here is about 43 and a half. Now I do want to hear what that box sound like compared to this one. I don't know what that's tuned to. But I know what this one's tuned to. So um, let me finished getting this stuff out and see if I can test fit it. So I bought this universal socket. As you can see, seven millimeter to 19, one fourth to three fourths. You can see. It's perfect, so let's get it off. All right, so pretty much 
Now our battery's out. I got my uh, little shot vac, vacuum that out. Got the batteries. Now I'm in the inside. I got, got one sub belt, working on the other. Actually, you can actually see. Man, that sucks. Sit this down somewhere. Got the subs out. Now, so get this box out. I got the box out. So now I can vacuum real quick. See there. Actually, before I vacuum, as you can see, I dropped two of my screws in here. So I'm about to find those real quick, if I can find them before I start vacuuming. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm glad I took all this out. I got a freaking puddle of water in here. That's not good. This part, I'm about to just start to use the shot back to get all this out. I don't really care if I can find them little screws or not. I can just always order some new ones. Oh, look. Anyway, but this is in here. What's holding this in? Nothing. All right, so let me go ahead and get this all situated. All right, got that vacuum out. Now I need to vacuum this out, and I think I'm gonna order a new uh, strip. I think this is why the water keeps getting in. All right. I was gonna do my four channel, but I'm just gonna wait. I really don't feel like messing with that. Um, put that back and you ready to test fit that, see if it'll fit. All right, got my little carpet cleaner. I just sprayed it. Now I got this little brush and I'm just Just cleaning it pretty much. I already vacuumed and everything. Now that piece is right there. Take that out to get the box out. So yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now. Say this is part one. Removing the subs. So right here. A little picture. Then part two would be me uh, test fitting this box. If it fits, see what it sound like with the ZV axis. And I go from there. Um, I still need to add more grounds back here. So I just got that one. I just got one run one of one run. One run of power wire. So I need to add another one of those. So it's, it's slowly. It's all to get in so just stay tuned. I don't think it's gonna fit. I don't know, let's see. Nah, no, that's not gonna fit. It's a little too wide. Yeah, that's not gonna fit. Yeah, it won't gonna fit, so. Stick to the box I got. Just got it cleaned. Um. Next, I'm gonna add some more grounds. So, let me do that. All right, while I'm sitting here debating where I'm gonna add my grounds, it started raining.
All right, as I sit in the car, I'm taking a break. As you can see, pretty much where everything is out. Um, getting ready to add some ground, clean clean some of that, and add some dyno mat back there. Then I'm gonna do the trunk. But I was thinking, how much is my sound system? How much did I spend on this car? with this sound system when i got it i didn't want to do anything but change the door speakers but of course being a bass head stuff always change you see it's raining pretty much got the car almost pretty much in the garage but you know, this is this is a hobby i got and get expensive as you can see um got everything out you know, sand deadening. Add another hundred to that. That's what I'm doing now. That whole back where the tire is was filled with water. It had a little puddle in there. No, vacuum that out. So now I'm adding grounds. About to sand deaden it. Well, I got to clean the first and the sand deaden it. Yeah, I'll go from there. But yeah, that's how much I on my sound system so just gonna keep spinning but so when i get a new vehicle I'm probably gonna try to find a tahoe suburban you find one of those that i'm gonna do from scratch i'm gonna show y'all series buying the alternators wire and all that so stay tuned for that let's open this then i got some Rubbing alcohol, we'll pretty much clean the surface in there. So let's see what this all comes with. What, no roller? Wow. I don't no roller. That sucks. Oh. It even says it. See if I can find some here. This sucks. All right, so I found out where that water came from. It came from this. This piece had popped out. Just gonna pop it back in there. Okay, there we go. Let's... Yeah, cool. All right, perfect. Then see my ground. I gotta clean all that up. So let me take care of that. All right, I got this off. As I can hear it before. So, this was. Right here. Sound like that. The, that was like that. So, these, these pops, these just, just pop out. Panel popper, seven millimeter. Let's pop these out. Now, got my rubbing hot claw. I'm gonna block this all down. Probably pop these out and just put it, pop a hole with a small screwdriver or something and just put these clips back. So, let me get to it. I'm pretty much, if I bring this back up, pretty much just keep it in inside let me do that all right this is what i got so far um at first i just had it going across so i went back as you can see i got little squares and stuff i just went back cut it out put it in there so up here so with this right i'll show you another sheet 
I would use this piece right here. Dropping everything. And I would stick it in here. As you can see, I got two pieces already. I got one back here and I got one here. So now I'm going to put one across here. Then, um, as you can see, I try to get these to go back in there. Got that one. Got that one. Okay. That's a piece. Actually, give me this because I can use you along here. So it didn't come with a roller. So I just got this cue ball and I just roll it on there. Pretty much. Yeah, that's all I've been doing, so I'll keep you updated. All right, I'm still at it. Uh, now I'm putting the side panels so you can hear. You can hear that? I come over here. Do it louder on the right. The thump on the left. So I got one, two, three. Four, five, five sheets left. All right. One, two, three, four. Five. Yeah, I got five sheets left. So the trunk is pretty much done. I just got this spot right here. Um, I did start under here. But I just got to pop this out. That's pretty much it for the, I'll probably just put this back. Cause it's right here, but that's really nothing. I'm pretty much satisfied. I want to see something. Oh, hell. Yeah. there go in the middle the whole middle so that's probably well I probably can get down in there that's probably underneath here and I can't get to it so as long as the base of it's fine um, take this off yeah, so should be good. I'm gonna put this back and start on the trunk. All right, it's day two. Um, had to take a break yesterday. I got a little too tired. Uh, pull my car out some. I can see my trunk's a lot heavier. You can tell I got the sound deck, man. Yeah, this truck's a lot heavy. Yeah, so I'm a I got one, two, three, four sheets left. Um, probably do that right there, right here. Um, probably put some behind my license plate. Um, 
So I did this quarter panel. Here, right there. Okay, difference. I got to do is just smooth this out the way. Take this out. Go behind there. Um, that's pretty much it. Let me get back to it. Make some more progress. Got this. I got right here so far. Then I did right there, right there. I said I do this side right here. Um, yeah, coming along. And I got two sheets, two sheets left. So, um, then a hot sound. I might go over it with another layer because I do want to fill this, fill this up. Then I want to take this back out and fill in the gaps with, uh, um, expanded foam, but I mean, other than that, it's kind of hard because right here, you tell the difference. I can't get in here with the uh, sound dampener, but I probably can spray some foam in there. that side so make a progress so, let me finish um found out where that water was coming from so oh, i got it locked Come on this side. so this is where your um water come in through like for your sunroof and stuff come down here and i just drops out this was out on the other side so all that water came in that's why my ground was so nasty and this was filled with water so i popped it back in gave it a little tug make sure i don't come back out but yeah i got that side yeah let me finish um I'll go ahead and measure this side so i can put those put this back up yeah all right so probably get some more debt and um cover this cover this cover this i got it right here so i put some uh, Expand the foam in here. Then I took this hole, put some in there. I don't think it's in there yet. Same thing with this side. Probably put some more on this side as well. Better right there. So. Uh, this just happened. I see the shot of it. Dang. We gotta clean this stuff up for the hardies. I got everything put back together. But you gotta see, I kinda had it to where it wouldn't show. So right now, if I see, I barely. I lift it. It's hard to lift. So watch, uh, just one finger. Bring it down. And then boom. All right, so now 
got that side back. I'm going to put this side back. Um, put the carpet in there and get the subs and stuff loaded. So, go ahead and get this knocked out. All right. Got them both over here. You can tell compared to how short and wide those are and how tall this is. So let's get them wired up. As we can see, do it one. Ooh, I just realized that. All right, so that's gonna change how I wanted to wire it. Hmm. Okay, I know, I know what I'm happy to do. I don't want it too, too low. Hmm, or do I? I don't got an ohm. That's why I need an ohm meter too. Because these are dual too. Yeah, I'm gonna do it too. I didn't realize these was doing one. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions on how I want to wire this. I got them wired down to one ohm. So pretty much you just take a wire, actually. You just take a wire. Ooh. So you put it one in a positive, then you come around and you put one in a negative. So you do that for both subs. Then it'll leave a positive and a negative out. And they both come out and connect to each other. Um, towards the end. So that's pretty much how you do that. So now I'm about to screw these bad boys down and load them in the trunk. Um, as I can see, my car kind of came back up with all this weight that's not back here. So, let's do that. Got the grounds. Still got positive. Let's get it. I got them in. Whew. It's like before. This time I'm making sure nothing is laying right here. Because that's how that did that and caused that. So, live and learn. Uh, so now I'm about to put these batteries back in, wire the batteries up, put my amp rack in, and hook this up. Um, I'll rip on my four channel later. Whew. That was a workout. I can put this back now. Move this piece out the way. This piece out the way. Just like so. Just like so. You. Filling out the batteries in and wired up. So what I did, like for these, the dual inputs. See one going to this battery, the other one going to this battery. Get the ground for that, ground for that. Next is 
put the amp rack over it. Then I'm gonna actually screw them down this time. And, uh, go from there. All right, finally got everything back. Um, got the LCT, LCI 2 Pro. Um, put this in here. I just got this wire left. It's just for my uh, vote meter. I'll worry about that later. So now I'm about to see what it sound like. Give this car a bath. So look. Boom. Let's just see what it sounds like. I can say it's a lot more violent in the inside than it is the outside. That sound didn't real, did real justice on that trunk. It's right, right now, it's around my sunroof. Around well, my sunroof don't work no more. Um, I think a wire got vibrated to loose, so. Um, yeah. Ooh. Um, it's a different song. I still gotta adjust it some more. Cosmic sound predators. 